Welcome back to The Local Show, a service of Safe Harbor Wills and Trusts and Geddes Federal Savings and Loan. The Local Show, featuring conversations with business owners, employees, and local business leaders about their successes, challenges, and reasons for doing business right here in Central New York. The Local Show, locally produced by Zoe Advertising. Now, here are your hosts, Tom and Steve. Welcome back, folks. You found The Local Show right here on 570 WSYR, or you might have picked us up on the FM dial at 106.9, or maybe you're watching YouTube, or possibly on any other device, yeah, uh, tablet. Maybe you don't know what you're saying. <laughs> the other day, I was saying to the kids, I said, where's my tablet? You see my tablet anywhere? And they go, Dad, what's a tablet? And they, they really didn't know what a tablet was. And they, they said, you mean your iPad? And I said, yeah, yeah, the iPad. Yeah. You know, I guess it's a pad. It's not a tablet anymore. Yeah. You know what? I, so out in the car, uh, driving around, you know, if we're listening to WSWire, which we do, yeah. um, I constantly hear your voice, Tom. <laughs> I'm like, there's Tom again. Right. <laughs> what was that got to do with my tablet? Guy. What does yeah. that got to do you know, with And then tablet? once in a while, I'll hear Dr. Anzalone, <laughs> yeah. her voice. Absolutely. You know, so I hear voices, Tom. You hear voices. <laughs> Well, that's good. At least you're not seeing dead people. That's a good thing. It is a good thing. Uh, so tell me about Safe Harbor Wills and Trusts. Well, uh, they got a workshop Monday if you want to get yeah. in on it. Um, they're, I know they're filling up. Right. Embassy, over at Destiny yeah, USA. Over at Embassy and, Suites. Yeah, right. Um, uh, right across. Sit down. You're going to hear a lot. Difference in a will and a trust and a revocable and an irrevocable and how to avoid probate and how to not lose it all to the nursing home. Yeah. Um, it really is educational. It's not a sales pitch. And that's what I really like about it. They teach people these things. Sure. Hey, you want to do business with them? Great. They're really good at it. They teach other attorneys to do it. Mm. But you can register on the website, uh, Safe Harbor Wills and Trust, uh, dot com. If old school, you want to do it, uh, you can call in 370 uh, 9977. So write that down 370 9977. Um, if you haven't made a plan to protect your home and life savings, you haven't made a plan to protect your home and life so savings. Safe Harbor Wills Trust dot com. There we go. Uh, Dr. Nicole Anzalone, it's good to see you. Uh, she is the owner, ladies and gentlemen, of Syracuse Hearing Solutions. How are you today? I'm doing very well. Thank you, Tom. Very good. Thank you for bringing props this time. Uh, <laughs> Nicole bought uh, a couple of ears and uh, no, they're not, not really. No. They're goggles. Actually, they're, the ears are attached to her. But well, you got some goggles. Tell us about those goggles that are sitting in front of you. Yeah. So these are special uh, fall risk screening goggles. So basically, um, they... Uh, if you you can't see if you're on the radio, but they right. uh, magnify your eyes. So we could take a look at which way your eyes are moving or beating. And this is important for balance testing. So if someone has vestibular yes. problems, balance problems, oh, you press the button on oh, it. Oh yes, of course. <laughs> That's Steve, see, see what I mean? <laughs> Folks, this is what I'm talking about. This, he Tom. says he doesn't do it. He just picked up the goggles and broke them. I mean, it's, it's just crazy. So, That's okay, so they're only about $10,000, don't worry about it. When in doubt, just so restart. Something like this, right? Oh, golly. Yes, yeah. now see, you can tell that Steve has beady eyes, of course. <laughs> yes, so, so how, what do these uh, goggles, and folks on YouTube can see it, what do they have to do with balance? Sure, so when someone is dizzy, um, their eyes may beat. So if, if they're, if they have vertigo, if they, they feel like beat? a- beat? They, so they say, beat, oh. so they move back and forth. Oh, that's a beat, okay. Or, or up and down, or gotcha. even turn or rotate torsionally. Right. Um, and depending on which way they move, that tells us where the problem is in the inner ear. Ah, so your eyes yes. tell us about your ears. <laughs> so if you ever something. spun someone around like in a chair really fast, we yes. can do that to Steve. Yeah, we do Steve. that to Steve, yeah. <laughs> Here we go, guys. <laughs> we'll spin them around and when you, you'll you see the eyes beat in the opposite direction or move in the opposite direction. And okay. when they stop, they may continue moving. So it's like a cartoon. Yes. Like when, like when you yeah. see something on a cartoon. So the American Institute of Balance, you're, the, tell us, you're getting education or certified or both. Tell us about what is that and how what's your place in that? Yeah, so um, since uh, dizziness is also ear related and that's what we do, anything ear related, we are getting certified um, by the American Institute of Balance as a center for specialty care. Um, so this is a really special training, a very specific training training, very intensive training um, by the best of the best in, in dizziness um, and neurodiagnostics. 
uh, of balance and equilibrium. So we're, we're doing that. We're actually going to Florida in a couple of weeks to train with them. I mean, these are the people that rehabilitate um, astronauts when they come back from wow. uh, missions um, because as wow. you could imagine, yeah, their yeah. sense of gravity is a kind little, of messed yeah, up, a little, twisted, yeah. a little messed up after after coming back from a long P- mission. Pretend I'm not an astronaut, and I'm Mary and Bill that live in Camillus, and there's some maybe some some stability issues. How does that affect Mary and Bill that live in Camillus? Well, um, about eighty percent or eighty to eighty five percent of the time, when someone's dizzy, it you know it could be due to your inner ear. So that's why we're measuring. And the problem is. Uh, so many people, especially above 65, fall, right? And it could be, it could mean, uh, la- yeah. you know, loss of independence, it can mean mortality. So it's very important to get this assessed so that it could prevent, potentially uh, prevent falls. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, and, and it's the number one complaint of people over the age of 60 to 65. Gotcha. So, folks, we're talking with Dr. Nicole Anzalone. She is a doctor of audiology, and she also has a master's in neuroscience, Mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So, you know, highly educated. Do you have other doctors in your practice? Yeah. So, uh, I have five other doctors uh, working with me now, and and they all have their specialties. Mm -hmm. I call them their superpowers. Right. Uh, So, we have some doctors that uh, work with pediatrics. We have some that... um, uh, do auditory processing evaluations, hearing aids, um, uh, balance as well. Sure. So a little bit of everything ear related. So why, folks, would you, for those of you even I, thinking think about having hearing I'm problems, thinking it. Go. why would you go to a big box store or think that you could put something in the, you know, buy something off the mail or you know a mail oh, order, right, and, or uh, off the internet, yeah, off yeah. the internet. That'd be crazy. You got to go see a doctor of audiology. Well, there's so. I mean, this is complex. Yeah, it's mm-hmm. yeah, right. Right, <laughs> and your hearing and your balance is very co- complex. Yeah, and it's important. I mean, this is part of your health care. So I, I don't think it is a good idea to go to a place that doesn't specialize in health care. Yeah, right, right. Or hearing health care because they're going to miss something, or you're not going to get the most treatment that you need. Yeah, you don't want to buy those TV ears and just no. turn them up really loud. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's, not, that's not the way to go. You, you might want to, but don't. Yeah. <laughs> it's, a bad, it's, it's a bad idea, Tom. Now, I know about your location out there in Camillus, and I've been there several times, but you have another location as well now. Yeah, so we're opening our second office in Fayetteville in the Linden Office Park. Um, so we're opening up on Monday the 16th, actually. That's, yeah, very about nice. That. And if someone wanted information, they can call the 468-2985 phone number. Yes, so uh, that, um, that's our main line. We uh, we will have a secondary uh, phone number right. as well. All right, so write this number down. If, if you have hearing challenges or dizziness or just it's time to maybe create a baseline, let's see how things are, they can get an exam, uh, 468-2985. Uh, and if you're a website savvy person, SyracuseHearingSolutions.com, all kinds of, uh, you can see the staff, you can see all the doctors sure. there too. How, how do people know that they might be uh, having cognitive issues? And when should they see you rather than like a medical doctor? Um, so we do cognitive screening related to hearing loss. So if someone's, um, you know, they're having trouble with um, everyday processing, they find that um, things are a little bit harder to remember, uh, everyday things that they they commonly do as normal activities mm-hmm. if they start to forget them, um, if they feel like um, they're not hearing well or processing what people are saying, um, it's always a good idea to get that checked out. So we do those um, screenings as well. Okay, so maybe it's good to check that out. Sometimes when I'm talking to my wife, I'm not processing what she's saying. I don't know if that I should just run over to you or not. Steve loves that toy. You, 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 folks, you really gotta go to the YouTube channel. Go to the YouTube channel and see Steve uh, with the googly eyes. We gotta spin him around now. Yes, and let, him, let him see that. That's Dr. Nicole Anzalone. Please uh, check her out at the uh, SyracuseHearingSolutions.com and get your hearing checked by a professional doctor. Thank you so much.
much and you have a great rest of the day thank you you too all right steve that's going to wrap up the local show you can go play with your googly eyes no no those are very expensive maybe i should have got you some of those eyes with the springs on for (laughs) you know (laughs) for christmas on behalf of the local show and zoe advertising and tom and steve god bless you and your families and make sure you get out and get some vigorous activity every day the local show is heard every saturday morning from 11 to 1 and then again on sunday morning from 7 to 9 listen together with a friend we find it's more fun that way until next week get down to business keep doing business locally and tell your friends about the local show right here on 570 wsyr 1069 fm the iHeartRadio app and on youtube at zoe advertising 3809